Okay, everyone. And it is Jertrell here once again. When I last left you off, I had just crashed this commsat back into Kerbin after somehow successfully, accidentally, getting it into a very eccentric orbit. When I say very eccentric, I mean excessively eccentric. But, that is not the point here. The point is, I'm going to be launching this again! The first, very, very, very first thing I'm going to do is rotate the thing. Because I was noticing that it was going onto the launch pad the wrong way. It was going... Well, if I'm looking at the launch pad, it was going up this way. I wanted it to go up this way so that it would bend over, you know, long, or flat in the gravity turn. Yeah, I still haven't slept yet. It's, like, for me, ten seconds after finishing the last video. So, yeah, I'm still very tired. But, point is... We're going to be launching this. Alright, so, save. And... Lunch. Mmm, breakfast. There we go. Wait for gravity to kick in, physics to kick in, whatever you want to call it. Now, some of you may have noticed that that loading screen takes an excessively long time on my computer. And that's because, well, my computer's got crap! So, computer controls on, launching. And it still wants to spin. Why does it do this? Spin back for me? No. Look at this thing. It's perfectly symmetric. Why is it doing this? Why? Oh, why do you insist on spinning like this? That's not like I can spin it back. Because I have no control surface. Alright, you know what? Instead of just, like, fighting it, and going back into a very eccentric orbit, I'm just going to add some control surfaces. I don't care. I really don't right now. I just want this thing to fly. Flee. Flee planet Kerbin. And go be, well, a satellite of planet Kerbin. Yeah, sleep deprivation. Kids, don't do it. It's not fun. Don't do drugs. I say as I smoke a cigarette. <laughs> Ugh. Save. Launch. I should probably name this Mark II. Or 1.1. Whatever. Um, it just came to my attention that you might hear a slight humming in the background of my videos. And that is due to my server that I keep in my closet. And that server hosts many, a many, a many, a many a fun thing. Hey, look, I had some control surfaces, and it works now. Kinda. Kinda. Yeah, it works. Works well enough. So yeah, that server hosts my Minecraft server. Um, blatant self-plug here. Um, up on screen at 4,000. And at 5,000 off screen. So yeah. Mental note for myself there. To put the plug to my server's forums and, well, link to the actual server up for you guys. 
Just thought you might enjoy it. I mean, I know people watching KSP probably aren't that into Minecraft. But I do also have a Minecraft that's what the smeg. Ugh. It's doing it again. I don't get it. I really don't get it. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna... Yeah. Screw it. It's a bottle rocket. <laughs> get it? Looks like a big bottle. Bottle rocket. Bad. Really bad joke. Uh, this is probably way too eccentric of a gravity turn for what I want to do, but... Whatever. Still got more vertical than horizontal, so I might be okay. You all may have noticed, I put two controllers on this thing. Like, two control packages. And the reason for that is actually very, very simple. I don't like space junk. So, if at all possible, I'm going to deorbit this the uh, body of this craft and leave the satellite alone up in orbit. Um, space junk leads to lag. Lag equals bad. Bad computer equals bad lag. Laggy video equals no views. So, yeah. Very, very good reason for me wanting to eliminate lag. Cycle computer. Um, yeah, I, I, I'm rambling. Whoa, 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 X. Oh. 50% power. Okay, ish. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, 110, that works. Okay. Oh, hey, I mean, this is going... Slightly better than I planned. Which way does this thing want to turn? Okay, that's that. That's that. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, so. I mean, I suck. I know I suck. Alright, X. Hey, it's mostly into an orbit. <laughs> okay, I guess I'm going way higher than I want to do. Um, one, we, okay, I am a good seven minutes out from my apoapsis, um, I'm going to attempt to circularize this? Alright, apoapsis. Uh, no. <sighs> that is far, far too much. Far, far too much. Whoa. Alright, 69. That works! Attempt re pointing of ship going very slowly. Okay, you know, I, I, knowing this now, I gotta say, I got like mass respect for the guys at NASA. They have like uber patience. I don't. This is more or less why I wanted the mech jet package in my KS good enough. Come on. Stop. Stop. I mean, seriously, this is why I wanted mech jab. Because I wanted my ship to not do this. I'm just glad I'm like minutes out. You know, I just don't. Just a little bit of thrust just to speed this process up. Of reorienting 
myself. Oh, come on. Not right, right there. I'll come back. Computer controls off. That off. Okay. Now, for those of you who don't know, the point of this aiming system here is to try and get as close to possible as perfect. As, well, spacily possible. Okay. Now, without throwing my orbit into too, well, janky of an orbit, I'm going to see where that has thrown me. As far as my orbit goes. Right, 167. Two. Yeah, no. Right, readjust my orbit for the new coordinates in space. Whoa. Uh, this is hard. Have, uh, what? Mouse! Oh, come on. I don't have all the time on carbon here. No, wait, close enough. 167. 160. Close. Close enough, I really don't care. No, can I please have some vestige of control. Whoa, wrong way. Uh, you know what? I'm stupid. Ah! What the? No. Why are you? No. Oh, off. Okay, point straight up. You know, I guess this is kind of why I have RCS in the first place. Okay. You know what? I don't even care right now. 168, 167. Because when I burn, when I go to do my burn, it'll be fine. Speaking of which, I should probably time warp out to that. Yeah, <laughs> get it, time warp. Uh, really bad joke. Like, really, really bad joke. Alright. How far out am I? The node? Node's right there. Um. I'm actually gonna wait until just a little bit after that node and do my burn then. Okay, node in. 15 seconds, T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. T plus, dot 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, burn. And kill. And where did that leave me? That has left me with a 194 by 144. Mm. Mm. Cycle. Next. And that is 154 by 200. Nope. Oh, screw it. Good enough. Catch the satellite. Flip this bad boy around. And stop using my power. Stop using computer controls. And computer controls 
on and burn. And yes, I don't care if I use up all my fuel doing this because, well, I put the satellite into orbit. I really don't care about fuel right now. And there we go. We're out. We are out of fuel. And I am on a northward tra trajectory, of all things, heading towards planet Kerbin. Or see us off. That will crash. No. Map. Crap. Switch to. No. No. X. Switch to. Here we go. I think. Yeah. There. One comm satellite in orbit. How's the batteries looking? Batteries are looking fine. They are able to survive the night. Okay. Computer controls off. We are in orbit, folks. I will see you. Actually, let's. Oh, no, I'm sorry, Dad. I'll see you on the launch pad for another launch. Space flight. Now. I realize I could have done like three of these satellites at once. I'm doing a two six six or six 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 orbit. I don't know enough about orbital mechanics to really pull that off. I mean, I suppose if you look up the numbers, I really don't care. Really, I don't. Um. See you all at the VAB preparing for another launch because this next satellite is going to have a special feature. Alright, everyone, uh, I have two minutes left in this video, so I think I'm going to cut it short to keep it within 20 minutes anyway. And the special feature, if you're completely blind, is RCS on the main rocket because I do not want to have that issue again. In fact, I think we need to add another special feature to this rocket. And that is going to be batteries. Why? Because batteries mean better flight time. Actually, these are what? 400, 800, 1,600? Um, what's this give me? 4,000? Oh, yeah. Smeg these. These weigh what? 0 0.02? And this weighs. 0 0.2? Hey, you know what? For the extra freaking charge. Might as well go for the one. It's slightly heavier and more than three times capacity. Or almost three times. No, wait. But one, two, three, one, two. Okay, no. Two and a half times capacity. So. So we will name this Mark 2. Save. And that's all for today, folks. Fly safe.